Meanwhile, why don't we show you a quick look at the website right now, which did in fact crash today. Pat Doris, though, did have a chance to log on, and he showed us a little bit of what it takes to actually sign up for a vaccine. Take a look. To begin with, you want to go to this website, covidvaccine.oregon.gov, and then look down to the very right bottom corner on the first page. You'll see a blue circle. See that? With a white envelope or something there. Well, click on that. That is where you want to start this whole thing. Once you click on that, it will pop up something called the Vaccine Information Tool, and it will tell you you can start a chat. Click on that. A bot will start speaking to you, the computer-generated thing. How can I help you? You want to know about your eligibility. I know you really want to schedule, but you have to do the eligibility. So it asks if you're 16 or over, and it says that it's limited. Just keep scrolling down as long as you qualify and you're in 1A or you're a teacher trying to get into this. And it tells you that Oregon's working in community partnership. Knowing that, you want to proceed. Yes, you do. And then that'll bring up another query. Are you 65 or older? I don't know why, but I just said no, because I guess that's true. Then it'll say, using the arrows, take a look at the following four professional categories. This is where you have to declare that you are eligible. So since this was a test, I decided to say that I was in healthcare, even though I'm not really, and don't worry, I didn't follow through on the schedule. So it says, are you interested in scheduling at the Oregon Convention Center? Yes, I am, because that's where everything's happening. And then it wanted me to answer questions. Have I had a severe allergic reaction to injectable medication? No. Have you had any doses of COVID-19 vaccine already? I said no. And then as we're continuing along, it just gets a whole bunch of questions. Have you tested positive for COVID-19? I said no. And then it says, have you had non-COVID-19 vaccine, like a flu shot, I guess, in the last 14 days? Again, I said no. And then have you been treated with COVID-19 monoclonal antibody? Uh, no. And once we pushed that, uh, I think we're almost there. There's a lot of questions to go through. According to the CDC, close contact. It goes through a whole description of what close contact is. And then at the bottom, it wants to know in the past 14 days, have you had close contact with someone with COVID-19? I said no. And I sure hope that's true. I think that's true. Based on your answers, you have been cleared to schedule your vaccination. And then click on the schedule now. What would you like to do? Don't go down to that. What would you like to do? Just stay with the schedule now. It'll pop up a new page. And I actually am a member of Legacy Health, and this looks exactly like their login page for something called My Health. You don't have to log in, just ignore that stuff on the right, and just scroll down, and you will see that there are a number of days and a number of times where you can schedule your vaccination at the Oregon Convention Center. So just to see if it really would, I clicked 11 o'clock, and shazam! I was to the last step of being able to schedule it. So if you can get in and get through and you really do qualify, this is how you can do it. Pat, got a shazam there. Uh, I know a lot of other people have struggled with that website. So uh, good luck to all of you, but we thought that'd be helpful to kind of show you how to get through it.